while I was painting, I was like, you guys are literally gonna make fun of me so much. Hi guys. Today, what I wanted to do is I'm gonna watch a Bob Ross painting video and I'm gonna try to paint along with it. I haven't painted it since, I don't even know, like since maybe art class in middle school. It's been a long time. And so I really wanted to get back into it. I'm gonna show you guys what happens. I was gonna go to Michael's before this, but I found all of these art supplies in my house. All right, we have some paints, let's go. These are all the supplies that I found. Paint brushes and like these. Oh my gosh, wait, sick. Okay, so we have all this stuff and look what I found. <laughs> like I don't have to go anywhere and I'm so excited. So I have all my stuff right here. I think I'm gonna go to my mom's office and film because there's like more light in there. Let's get started. Okay, so this, there's not like a clear shot of it in the video, but this is what I'm gonna try to do. This is like the finished product. I feel like for some reason, like that's the easiest one. They all look so incredibly hard. I'm a little bit worried about it, but I'm excited. These are the colors I ended up finding. Sorry, my camera died. So, this is what we have so far. 
if you don't look at his painting at the same time frame, then it's not like the worst painting in the world. Like there's mountains and there's the sky. It's not that hard. But I forgot a huge step. I like wasn't supposed to connect the mountains and the foreground. And that was like really not good. I think my painting's just gonna have mountains and I'm like not sure how the foreground's gonna go. But yeah, so this is what we have so far. I'll show you what part I'm about to be at. Let's take, let's take some titanium. So you can see like the mountains and then there's like the, the foreground has like some white, it looks like fog or mist in front of it. And I just like did not do that. So I don't know the rest of the video. I will just have to see. Also, I really thought this was going to be a stress relief for me and like a relaxing video and like I could just paint and it'd be fine. And I'm like so anxious. <sighs> it's probably because I'm filming it and like I also did a lot of things wrong and like I literally haven't painted since 8th grade and I'm a senior in college. It's just so Okay, so all I did while I was off camera was make these like little trees at the bottom. And I think I'm almost done. All I'm gonna do now is finish like a big evergreen right here like he does in the picture and maybe do like another one right here, but we'll just see. I'm done. This is the finished product. Yay! Honestly, if I had like a smaller canvas, it definitely would have been more relaxing because that was so stressful and I didn't have liquid white, which was a huge deal if you've ever seen his videos. I'm like so drained now. So I'm probably never gonna do this again. So if you didn't like this video, just still subscribe because I'm never doing it again. That's my painting from Falling Bob Ross. I haven't painted in eight years. Don't make fun of me for it. I was like, <laughs> while I was painting, I was like, you guys are literally gonna make fun of me so much. I hope if any of you guys like look at the Bob Ross things and you're like, oh my gosh, this looks so easy, like I can do it. I hope that you'll try because I think if I wasn't recording and if I had like a smaller canvas, then it would have been really relaxing and it would have been fun to just like see how it turns out. But since I had a huge canvas and I didn't have everything I needed and I'm kind of like stressed for time, even though this literally took me like four hours, like maybe longer than four hours. And his video was 30 minutes. Also comment down below any videos that you guys want to see from me and I'll film them. See ya. I'm